Yo, what is going on you guys? My name is Corbin and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing an outfit diary. Over the course of the last week, I basically recorded a fit check outfit breakdown in front of the mirror for you guys every single day. And I've also been recording a few little vlog clips here and there that I'll be sprinkling in throughout the video as well. But yeah, I figured that this would be just like a super fun, casual way to show you guys what I'm wearing on a day-to-day -day basis and also give some insight in regards to where my personal style is at at the moment as well. Um, but yeah, without any further ado, I don't really want to spend too much time talking during the intro portion of this video. So let's just get right into today's video. <music> Yo, what is going on you guys? Today is Monday, the first day of this like what I wear in a week style video that I'm trying out here. Um, FYI, I am working from home today. So admittedly today's outfit is a little bit lackluster, um, but you know what? I tried to keep this as like realistic as possible. Uh, I'm not really here for the capping on the internet type stuff. Um, I'm not trying to pretend like I'm wearing some kind of crazy outfit to work from home when realistically on these kinds of days, I'm typically wearing something exactly like this. I'm going to be wearing a pair of sweats and a t-shirt because that's what's real. Um, but in regards to what I am actually wearing today, um, I have got on this only New York t-shirt that I don't know, I've had it for forever, honestly. Um, I used to really be into Only New York. Um, I mean, I still like the brand as a whole, but just in terms of my own like day-to-day -day style, um, I mean, I'm not necessarily wearing Only NY that often anymore, but this is just like a really kind of like chill, comfy t-shirt. So that's what we have on up top, making our way to the bottoms. For pants, I've got on this um, New Balance track pants. Um, I mentioned this in a previous video that I got these from TJ Maxx and you know what? I love the hell out of these pants. They were like 10 to 15 bucks I think and I literally wear these all the time. Um, these are honestly just kind of like my go-to like work from home casual day at the crib type of type of sweatpants. Um, then making our way to the shoes, um, no lie, I usually don't wear shoes in the crib, but I figured I would show out a little bit for the video. So for y'all, I put on these black leather Birkenstock Bostons. And with that, that is a completed fit check for this work from home Monday afternoon. Um, it's like four o'clock right now. So, I mean, I'm kind of winding down for the day. Uh, I don't have any more client calls or meetings. I just need to like wrap up a few emails and finish up some little administrative type tasks. And then I'm signing out. Um, today's actually like one of like the first like really nice like spring days here in Chicago. Uh, so I think after work, my girlfriend's probably gonna come over and I think we're gonna go for a little bike ride along the lakeshore. Um, so if I do remember to uh, record, I'm going to try to film a couple of little B-roll clips for you guys um, of that. So yeah, besides that, um, that's all I got for you guys right now. But hopefully I will have on something a little bit more interesting in tomorrow's clip for Tuesday. But until then, I will catch up with you guys later. Peace. <music> Yo, what is going on today is Tuesday, day two of this what I wear in a week video. Today is my first day back in the office for this week. So dressed up a little bit more than yesterday. Um, on top, I've got on this like knit polo shirt from J. Crew. Um, on the bottom, I have on these new pair of Stadt canvas pants that I'm really loving at the moment. Um, and then on the bottom, I've got on these um, leather Chelsea boots from Chamula. And that is the complete fit for today.
Yo, what is going on you guys? Today is Wednesday and I actually just got home from work and I realized that I forgot to show you guys my outfit this morning. So figured I'd give you guys a little outfit rundown right now. Um, so up top, I have got on a Uniqlo U white t-shirt. Um, if you don't already know this, which I don't know how you wouldn't, um, Uniqlo, for one, makes like the best basic t-shirts, but in my opinion, the Uniqlo U t-shirt specifically is so dang nice. Like I, it's like the perfect weight, has a really nice um, neckline to it. Um, and then obviously being from Uniqlo, it is quite affordable as well. Uh, so honestly, like I love just stockpiling these in my wardrobe um, and I wear them all the time. Um, on top of the t-shirt, I've got on a vest, which is also from Uniqlo. Um, I got this like last winter or fall and I haven't really had a ton of opportunities to wear this, but now that we're kind of uh, in a little bit warmer weather, I can kind of break this out a little bit more and I don't know, I'm really, really digging it so far. Um, and then making our way to the bottom, uh, honestly you have the same bottoms uh, on as yesterday. These are the Staatsballett canvas pants. Um, so I actually just got these super recently from their most recent drop and I've been loving them. Um, these aren't like crazy baggy or anything, but like honestly, it's a little bit baggier than um, most pant silhouettes that I typically tend to gravitate towards. Um, so honestly, it's been really fun kind of playing around with like this new kind of silhouette for me. Um, I'm probably gonna show like a little more in-depth review and like talk about these pants a little bit more in like a future pickups video. Uh, but just to kind of give you some details here, like. Uh, it's so nice. It's just, it's perfectly like high-waisted and sits on the waist really nicely and then just kind of perfectly straight and like billows uh, endlessly upon the shoe. Um, for this iteration, they did 34-inch inseams as well as a 31-inch inseam. Um, personally, I am a short king. Um, I'm about like 5'9". Uh, so I got the 31-inch inseam and it's still a little bit long, so I threw a little cuff on it. Um, but yeah, I might end up getting these hemmed just a bit down the line, but for right now, I kind of like the long inseam. Um, then on the feet, I've got the same shoes on as yesterday. These are the Chamula uh, Chelsea boots. Yeah, these are pretty, pretty rad. Um, in terms of accessories, I've got on this like Western belt that I got from like this vintage store in Boston a couple of years ago and then I have on like a little a little ring as well that I got off of eBay a couple of years ago as well. Um yeah, that is the outfit breakdown for today. Um I will catch up with you guys probably tomorrow. Peace. <laughs>what is going on you guys today is thursday and this is the fit that i am rocking with today to break this down for you guys up top i've got on this jw anderson uniqlo chambray shirt that i got maybe like a year or so ago um really love like the collar and the double breasted pockets on this it's like a really great just spring summer casual shirt on the bottoms, I've got on these vintage military trousers that I got off of Grailed maybe like two years ago. Um, I really love these. They're nice and lightweight and um, it's like a really nice relaxed fit to them. They go well with a lot of different outfits that I wear in like the spring summertime. And then making our way to the feet, I've just got on some leather Birkenstock Boston's. And that's the fit for today, keeping it pretty casual for a pretty hot spring day here in Chicago.
What's going on, y'all? Today's Friday. Working from home today, so you already know I'm coming back with another just chill, relaxed vibe kind of an outfit for today. Let me break this down for y'all real quick. Up top, I've got on the Stussy Our Legacy Workshop collab t-shirt. I want to say I got this like last fall, I want to say. But yeah, Stussy and Our Legacy are like two of my favorite brands. Um, and I'm definitely a huge fan of this like ongoing collab series that they've been doing the last couple years. Um, so yeah, really love that. Here's what the back is looking like. Um, hopefully you guys can see that. And then making our way to the bottoms. For pants, I've got on these vintage Levi 501s in this super beautiful like dusty chocolate brown kind of a color. I'm not sure how the camera's picking it up right now, but these are so, so amazing. I love these so much. Um, I got these a couple of weeks ago off of eBay and I've literally been wearing them nonstop since I've gotten them. I will definitely be showing these off in an upcoming pickup video, so stay tuned for that. And then on the feet, I've got on these New Balance 2002 running shoes. These are pretty, pretty cool. I like these a lot. Um, if I end up going out later tonight, I may swap the shoes out for a pair of like boots or something. Um, but yeah, other than that, this is pretty much how I'm coming for today. So this is probably going to be the last kind of outfit talking clip um, for this video. Um, but if you guys did enjoy this kind of content, please definitely let me know. Um, I really enjoy doing this kind of like daily styling, kind of casual vlog style videos. Um, so if you do enjoy that kind of a thing, please let me know and I would definitely try to make it happen in the future. I'm really trying to get back into the groove of like making regular YouTube content. Um, I know I've kind of been gone for a couple of months now at this point, but I think after this video, I'm going to try and really set like a more regimented schedule so that I can post, if not every week, every other week or something like that. Um, so after this video goes up, I'm planning on doing a spring pickups video. Um, I've been acquiring a ton of new stuff recently that I'm really excited to show you guys because um, I think you'll enjoy seeing it. Um, but yeah, other than that, this is probably where I'm going to sign off for today's video. Um, I do have a couple of friends that are in town this weekend and we're going to a concert tomorrow night. So if I remember to record anything, I will probably try to splice it in after this clip. Um, but yeah, besides that, I'm going to sign off here. I appreciate you guys for watching. Um, I hope that you're healthy. hope that you're doing well. And I hope that you have an amazing rest of your day. Um, and I will see you very soon in the next video. Peace.